Today I'd like to share with you how I got these bright rainbow nails using Sharpies. I used a silver base layer to give the finished manicure a shimmery metallic look. For this manicure you will need isopropyl alcohol or rubbing alcohol. You can find this pretty easily at most chemists or supermarkets. Sharpies or other permanent markers to make the colours of your rainbow. A base colour nail polish. I've used Elite 99's One Step Gel in a pearl silver. Normal nail polish works too. A top coat to seal in your gradient. A brush to blend your colours with. I've used a gel brush, but you can use any brush with synthetic bristles. A shot glass or a small saucer for your alcohol. Paper towel or some tissues to blot your brush. An orange stick or another tool to clean up with. A lamp to cure your gel, if that's what you're using. Peel off base coat. I've used Sally Hansen's big peel off base coat because that's what I could find easily in my local shops. I started with a peel off base coat so that I can change my nails quickly as I'm using gel polish and I can't be bothered waiting to soak it off. I apply a thin coat and wait for it to dry. Then add a second coat and let it dry completely. This product recommends you apply a single thick coat but I find that two thin coats work just as well and dry a lot more rapidly. I get impatient pretty quickly. my colour coat. Today I'm using a pearl silver in a one step gel so that means I don't have to fuss about with a primer or a gel base coat. Apply a thin layer, clean it up with an orange stick and cure it. I add a second coat of colour to make a nice solid base. Pop it into cure and then on to the next step. Before breaking out the permanent markers I prep my fingertips with a coat of peel off base coat. You can use a specific peel off latex tape but I don't have any so I used the Sally Hansen's peel off base coat instead. I painted right around the cuticle, making sure not to get any on the nail, and finished by painting the front of my fingertip. Blending the sharpie for this mani gets messy. Now comes the fun part. Draw on your nails with sharpies. I cover about two thirds of the nail with the lighter colour, then add the darker colour over the remaining part of the nail. I like to feather out the dark colour to make blending a little bit easier later on. Next, grab your brush and dip it in isopropyl alcohol. Wipe off the excess on the side of your glass or dish. If the brush is overloaded, the alcohol will flood your cuticles and cause staining. I know this because I did it a lot. Use the alcohol to thin the sharpie and blend until you're happy with the gradient. I'm not being too fussy with mine because I find I tend to brush off too much of the colour if I go over it too many times. If you do end up doing this, don't worry. Just wait for the alcohol to dry and then draw the sharpie on again. I actually ended up doing this on my index finger. Thankfully this technique is pretty forgiving, which is great because I'm not the most coordinated person in the world. Make sure you go over all of the sharpie with your wet brush so you have an even texture and you don't get little bits of colour pulling on the edges. Plus, doing it this way helps the silver colour to peep through and gives the manicure a more metallic look. Clean up the cuticles a little bit with some more alcohol and then peel off the glue layer on your skin. sure the nail is fully dry before adding your top coat. If you don't, you'll get weird ripples like I did on my thumb. I was a bit too impatient. Then cure your top coat and enjoy. Look at that pretty rainbow. You can be super smug because you did it yourself. Yes! <laughs>